हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल दिस राजा वर्क फ्रॉम आई आई टी मद्रास अपार्ट फ्रॉम बी एट एम एस स्कॉलर एट आई आई टी मद्रास आई एम ऑल्सो डूइंग आई आई टी एम बी एस सी ऑनलाइन डिग्री प्रोग्राम इन डेटा साइंस सो रिसेंटली आई गॉट माई फाइनल रिजल्ट लकली आई गॉट एस इन ऑल सब्जेक्ट्स ऑल फोर सब्जेक्ट विच आई हैव टेकन सो इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट अ लिटिल बिट अबाउट द ग्रेडिंग पॉलिसी एंड हाउ सी जी पी एज कैलकुलेटेड एंड एस सी जी पी एज इम्पॉर्टेंट और नॉट फॉर योर प्लेसमेंट और अदर थिंग सो लेट एस बिगिन दिस वीडियो सो फर्स्ट लेट एस टॉक अबाउट द ग्रेडिंग पॉलिसी सो ग्रेडिंग पॉलिसी एट आई आई टी एम बी एस सी ऑनलाइन डिग्री प्रोग्राम इज क्वाइट सिमिलर टू अवर ऑफलाइन डिग्री एट आई आई टी मद्रास बट इट डिफर्स फ्रॉम द फैक्ट दैट एट ऑफलाइन डिग्री इट इज़ रिलेटिव ग्रेडिंग बट इन ऑनलाइन इट इज़ एब्सोलूट ग्रेडिंग एब्सोलूट ग्रेडिंग मीन्स द वाट एवर ग्रेड यू गॉट इट डिपेंड्स ऑब्सोलूटली ऑन योर ओन परफॉर्मेंस बट इन द केस ऑफ रिलेटिव ग्रेडिंग इट डिपेंड्स ऑन द परफॉर्मेंस ऑफ अदर्स ऑल्सो मीन्स इफ योर क्लास इज परफॉर्मिंग अ लिटिल बिट हायर देन योर परफॉर्मेंस सो योर ग्रेड विल गेट डाउन सो इफ यू हैव स्टडीड स्टैंडर्ड डिविशन एवरेज वेरियंस इन योर सेट यू कैन रिलेट इट सो फॉर रिलेटिव ग्रेडिंग स्टैंडर्ड डिविशन इज यूज फॉर ग्रेडिंग बट इन आई टी एम बी एस सी ऑनलाइन डिग्री प्रोग्राम absolute grading is followed because there are lot of candidates from the right background so it absolutely depends on your own performance if your total score is above 90 then you will get s grade s grade is the maximum grade you can get uh, it is equivalent to 10 gpa and in the similar manner you get a b c d like that it is available in the student handbook you can refer to this so uh, if i talk about the grading policy so it includes a 10% weightage of the graded assignments graded weekly assignments in every week uh, there is a one graded assignments so you have to do it diligently so i think the average of the best 10 graded assignments are included so if you do it by yourself your understanding will also improve and apart from that it will also help in improving your grade so its 10% is included in the final score apart from that your uh, the practice assignment and the mock test is also included in the final score many of you ignore the practice assignment and mock test but if you uh, do it diligently you can get up to 10 uh, marks extra as a bonus so please do it uh, it may vary from term to term may, maybe iit madras will change the grading policy in the next term based on the student feedback but as of now uh, you get uh, 10 marks extra for bonus Uh, i am just talking about this term maybe for the next term the subjects may differ so you uh, you can refer the grading uh, grading policy so i am talking about in general so apart from that i have seen that many of you uh, do not attempt the quiz to and let me tell you there are two quizzes and one end sem so many of you uh, uh, do not attempt the quiz to but if you are not attempting the quiz to you are just losing your 10 marks because uh, if you are not attempting the quiz 2 so your quiz 1 marks is only included in the final score uh, so it is like that you can refer the exact formula it is like that uh, i think it is uh, 0.6 uh, into final score plus 0.2 into the quiz 1 plus 0.3 into quiz 2 it is like that you can refer the exact formula apart from that Uh, if if you get the final score uh, the final group score is in the form of the grade so it depends on your total score if it is about 90 it is like as uh, if it is between 80 to 90 it will be a so for calculating the cgpa you just have to multiply your gpa into the credit uh, and then take the average of it for example if you get 10 in one subject 10 means s in one subject a in another subject uh, b in another subject c in another subject so it will like that 10 into 4 plus 9 into 4 uh, plus 8 into 4 plus 7 into 4 divided by 4 plus 4 plus 4 plus 4 means you have to multiply the credit into the gpa and then add it and then divide it by total sum of gpa uh, total sum of credits all subjects are of four credits so you have to calculate like this otherwise in the simpler way you can also 
just calculate the average of it but the exact formula is like this only you have to multiply the gpa into credit and then add it and then divide by the total sum of the credits uh, but in if you simplify simplify it it will come out to the average of the four uh, credit uh, four gps so uh, if you want to calculate it you can just add the all the gps and then divide it by uh, four like that so in the same in this manner you can calculate it if you have taken uh, two three subjects you can calculate it by like that so at the end if i talk about the importance of the cgpa so in the first you will find that cgpa is quite important uh, you will heard that if you do not have good cgp you will not get good placement you will not get good opportunity but at the end you will find that uh, your skill uh, is the only thing which matter the most so if you have acquired the good skill good understanding of the subject while going through the subject uh, so at the end if you, even you have a low cgpa so you can easily get the good placement or good opportunity uh, later on after this degree i have i am telling this on the basis of my experience although my cgpa is quite good but i have seen that many of my friends who have low cgpa uh, they have secured a good placement but i am want to say that you need to have the minimum cgpa like it should be above the 7.5 uh, if you have uh, above the 8 it is quite well and good but please try to maintain it above 7.5 it will be better for your uh, future also so so if, if you have got low grades low cgpa low marks and even if you have not cleared the subject it does not matter at the end the thing which only matters is the your understanding and your skill which you have gained through this degree or any other degree so please try focus on the learning or the new things instead of worrying about the grades grades are important but at the end your learning and understanding are the only thing which matter the most i am saying on the basis of my experience what i have seen what i have heard what i have experienced so please look into it uh, so goodbye take care have a nice day happy learning and you have you have not subscribe my channel yet please do subscribe i will keep posting like this video of the campus and of other stuffs so take care goodbye